face looks familiar. Well, that's June Ballard, <laughs> Tarzan's sister, beast of the Amazon. She's married to Guy McAfee. The captain has moved to Vegas now, but the two of them still have juice. Phelps, traffic. Detective Phelps. Hey, Bukowski. Long time no see. You could have called this in by megaphone, Enrique. <laughs> Phelps, this is Enrique Gonzalez. Enrique was a pretty decent middleweight. What do we have, Gonzalez? Broad drives right through the empty lot and off the side of the escarpment. Her story is that a movie producer doped her and her friend and sent the car over the cliff. Was anyone hurt? Driver's beat up. Not too bad, considering if she hadn't hit that billboard, we'd be scraping both of them off the pavement. Passengers are Jessica Hamilton. She's just a kid. She's pretty knocked around. Kid gonna be all right? I think so. They've taken her to Central Receiving. If you want to take a look around, stall the ambulance. Thanks. Do that. One more thing. Watch out for the driver. She cuts rough. Hey, out of the way, bub. Uh, if you're looking for the coroner, he's down by the crash site. You want to see this, Phelps? There, laid out on the trunk. And that isn't even the best part. find them. They were stuffed in the young lady's handbag. I'll run a trace for semen when I get back to the lab. They're lucky they weren't more badly injured. Must have been unconscious. Being relaxed tends to lessen the soft tissue damage. Drunk driver? Maybe not. How so? Well, a head I found without a body piqued my interest. See what you think. <laughs> Alas, poor Yorick. I knew him, Horatio. <clears throat> Is it real? No. I think it's supposed to be a replica of an Indian shrunken head. It's some kind of curio or movie prop. See the casting marks? Made from. Plaster of Paris would be my first guess, then paying it. So we can rule out the murder angle? No, you can rule that in. That thing was wedging the accelerator to the floor. Whoever did it wanted these women dead. How does someone manage to tip their ride straight off a cliff? If the driver's in a fit state, we should ask.
Mrs. McAfee, we would like to ask you a few questions, if that's okay. I prefer to use my maiden name, June Ballard. You might be familiar with some of my work. Can you tell us what happened here? You're kind of cute for a cop. Maybe a bit on the serious side. What about me, June? I'm a big fan of Beast. You? I don't like. Keep out of this. We understand that you're still suffering from the effects of the accident, Mrs. McAfee. The officer says that you claimed that you were drugged. Who did this to you? That rat slipped us on Mickey Finn. It's no wonder I feel so dopey. I can't remember. It's a serious offense to withhold information from the police during a criminal investigation, madam. I told you to call me June. You're making me feel like an old lady. And don't bother your handsome head about this. My husband will settle the score with Mark Bishop. What can you tell us about the passenger in your car? Jessica Hamilton. Poor Jessica. It's been a rough day for her. She's desperate to break into movies. What more can I say? And she's your protege? <laughs> you could say that. Yeah, that's a nice way to put it. <laughs> We found a shrunken head that was used to tamper with your car. You see, I normally don't drive off cliffs. The last thing I remember is getting behind the wheel. You don't remember where the head came from? I don't know anything about a head. Why is everybody talking about a goddamn head? Isn't anyone interested in how I am? You mentioned a Mark Bishop. You think he might have had something to do with this? He is a movie producer. As for his involvement, you just leave it to me and my husband to worry about. I want to know what happened between you two that made him want to commit a double murder. Bishop offered me a part in his picture. Then he withdrew it. Fact is, we had a deal. I pressed him on it, and this is where I end up. Mrs. McAfee, I think it would be in everyone's best interest if you accompanied Patrolman Gonzalez back to the receiving hospital. I'm going to be okay. These guys can take me home after. My lawyer and I have talked to the news house. Mrs. McAfee, you are still under the influence of narcotics, and you're likely to go into shock once the drugs wear off. And I thought you were a heel. It's nice of you to be concerned. I think we're good here. Let's go see what we can shake out of the kid. You see the broad who bombed over the cliff? They say she's a movie star. Will this make it into the paper? I want to make next? sure that kid is all right. Come on, Phelps. Central Receiving Hospital.
read about it. Whoa! Easy! Roger, 11K en route. Hello, Detective Phelps, here to interview a Jessica Hamilton. Jessica Hamilton? Oh, yes. She's in the room, right behind you, Detective. You can't hold me here. No! I don't need to be manhandled by a doctor. I need my lawyer! Hey, where is the telephone? Do you know who I am? Feeling better since this morning, Jessica? A little. My head still feels swimmy. Not much help. Hello, Jessica. Uh, my name is Cole Phelps. I'm a policeman. I'd like to talk to you about your accident, if that's okay. Um, okay. Is this going to take a long time? That's correct. Much longer? Yes. Are you feeling better? Can you tell me what you remember about the crash? It's all kind of fuzzy. I remember waking up here. Nothing happened yesterday. So this is what a morgue looks like, huh? Did we run out of morphine again? Is it a fracture? You could have died in a crash, Jessica. Why would someone want to kill you? Someone wants to kill me? I wouldn't know anything about that. I just went along with Junie. She knows all about the movie business. Is your head feeling better? We need to get in touch with your parents, Jessica, to tell them what has happened. Oh, you don't need to worry them. They sent me along to stay with Aunt June. They trust her to take care of me. Will I get out of here today? I'm sorry. You're lying, Jessica. How are we going to make this right if you lie to us? Please, Detective, why would I lie to you? Do you know how much the operation is? Yes. Because you're a runaway, Jessica, and you don't have your parents' permission to be here. Now, do you want to tell me what really happened? I went with Junie to this strange place. It's difficult to remember. Someone gave me a drink to calm my nerves, and then I felt faint. I think I must have passed out. Mind if I cop a nod while I wait? Yes. How did you meet Mr. Bishop? Well, Junie is a big movie star. You probably know that. She's doing a new movie. Is there a doctor I can speak with right this minute? Yep. What's the story with Bishop and Mrs. McAfee? Why does he want the two of you dead? That can't be true. Mr. Bishop seemed very happy today. I mean, 
yesterday. And that's why he wedged a shrunken head against the accelerator pedal and punted the two of you over an escarpment? I overheard Junie speaking to him on the phone a couple of times. Screaming, really. She can be very hard sometimes, Junie. But they seemed okay yesterday, like they worked it out. Do we need surgery? I know what happened to you, Jessica. Where exactly did it take place? Please, it's scary. It's really difficult to think of anything. How much is this gonna set me back? Can we leave soon? That's correct. Jessica, I really need you to help me here. I remember the mermaid. Was it the mermaid in the movie too? No, it was on the front of a building. We pulled up in front of the mermaid. Thank you, Jessica. You've been a big help. Here's my card. If you think of anything or if you need some help, just get in touch, okay? Okay. I think it might be a good idea if you went back home till you felt better, Jessica. I couldn't do that, officer. What if I got the part and I wasn't there? It's the tale of this town, Cole. Lambs that go willingly to slaughter. Who the hell is that? Must be her lawyer. He certainly expedited her release. I don't like it, Cole. Why is she in such a hurry? We should follow her. There she goes. Come on. Definitely up to something. She seems to have made a remarkably speedy recovery. Easy, Cole. Better back it off. Get in there and see what she's up to. 